What are you talking about? G -g -g Greeks and Egyptians have lost harmony with each other. The g -g gods are displeased because of it. I'm Nanefer, and I don't know if I'm g -g 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 Greek or Egyptian. I'm an orphan. Lost harmony? What do you mean? The Egyptian g -g -g goddess Wajed is sending snakes into g -g Greek quarters at night. Only g -g Greeks have been killed. We are out of b -b 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 balance. See for yourself. Just n n north of the villa. Okay. I will look into this cast. That was harder than it should have been. <laughs> Neck! What was that? The gods are rumbling. It came from just north of here. Must have something to do with this curse. What? Ah! I can smell the burnt flesh. This man was pinned down and died in the blaze. The structure is badly damaged. I cannot go any further. The trail leads outwards. I should look around the courtyard. This jar does not belong here. I think there is movement inside. Another foreigner cursed by Wajet. That is three this week. Those useless Greeks had it coming, if you ask me. But what do I know? I am just the lowly Egyptian caretaker who cleans up after the naked Yadit. Hey, be careful what you say. People have died. I need to look around. What you need to look at is the color of your skin, son. Harmony is what we need. Not more senseless judgment. Look, some of us have built a shrine in a cave under what is left of the great temple. Why don't you come and honor Wajet with us? Egyptians have to stick together. Maybe I will, after I look around. are the same as the ones I saw in the Greek area. They are breeding the snakes here. Gods, I hate snakes! Shrine to the serpent goddess Wajet. By the sound of it, I do not have to find the caretaker after all. He has already found me. He cannot escape! This is what 
Ptolemy has done to Egypt. A land out of balance, full of hatred and strife. At least I can rescue the hostage. He's being held by the caretaker's men at Panuki. The caretaker is using the goddess to kill Greeks. Why such hatred? I would be sad. It is just as Nanifer warned through his stutter. Egypt has lost harmony. The caretaker's hideout must be up ahead. Smell of rotting flesh. Well, at least he won't escape. You beat him so badly, he's lying in his own blood. <laughs> he can't even stand. <laughs> Stupid Greek! He had it coming. He hasn't even started to bleed yet. Wait till the caretaker gets to him. You're here. I d d d d don't think so. They b b b beat me. Be still. I will carry you out. Gifts from the caretaker to his men. Another shrine to the snake goddess Wadjet. They beat me. They beat me because they thought I'm Greek. Wait. What happened to your stutter? I was scared when I first met you. It makes me stutter. By the gods, is nothing true. Well, you are alive, Nanifa. Be thankful. I'm alive, but Egypt is out of balance. You must know, Magi, the law is harmony between all peoples. May Serapis unite us all. That is the end of the caretaker's cult. Nanifer is right. Egypt is out of balance. And that is the order of ancients doing. Are you Theodorus' men? Yes. And who are you? He is the Siwan. I come on his behalf. He'll be joining us shortly with instructions. Good. The soldiers are reeling. But it won't be long before reinforcements arrive. Come.
Theodoros. Ready your blades and check your arrows. Theratos will be back at the camp before sunrise. You're with me, but don't forget, he is mine. What is your stake in this? This is more about him than it is about your war. My father grew figs in the Fayum. The best. Theratos taxed him. An Egyptian has no choice but to pay. One season, the harvest was so poor that my father struggled to give his cut. Theratos figured him for a cheat. He took a bite of fruit to prove his point. He got a mouthful of worms. His men laughed, but Theratos was furious. I watched as my father was hanged from his own tree and picked at by every animal in the region. Theratos embodies the unjust. He is why I am who I am. I need you, Bayek. Trireme! The gods have brought us together for this! Justice will be served today! No! For Egypt! For your father, Theodorus! Veratos dies today! Leave no one alive! Clear the camp! to loot you always. Bandits will be here again soon, brothers. We'll make our final stand. Give them a few scars before they slit our throats. We're with you, Rai. We are all tired of running. Our blood oath to the soil 
is unbreakable. Why are you hiding amongst these ruins? Amidjai, the gods show mercy at last. My name is Rai, and this is what's left of my family. Bandits chased us from our farms. We have nowhere else to go. We have nothing of value, yet they've pursued us for days across this wasteland. I've seen many bandits. They are cynical and callous. They killed so many. My father, my son. Those here are all who remain of our village. The bandits will come again to finish us. Stand with us, Mejai. Help us get vengeance at least. Vengeance is my creed. I will help you. Tell me your plan. There is a cliff not far from here. From there we'll be able to see the whole area and plan our defense. Let's go. This wasteland is perilous. If it's not bandits, it's hyenas or some other beast. Thankra, my father taught me how to use a bow. That is a nice weapon. It has an unusual make. When my father gave it to me, it was taller than me by three hands. Boys teased me without mercy. Now it's a sadness to me. It only reminds me of him. Chained slightly. They look ancient. What is this place? You are fast along the rocks, Rai. I know these caverns. They are a natural temple. What is that necklace you wear? An old eagle skull. I hope it brings us luck. Stay here for hours. Okay. Enough of the view. We have to plan. Wherever the bandits come from, my brothers will be ready for them in the ruins. I'll stay up here and keep watch. When they show, I'll give a signal. Then I'll attack from behind. I mean no disrespect, Rai. But you are not soldiers. These bandits are killers. Your farmer friends may not walk away from this fight. I know, Bayek. I'm scared out of my mind. If your family died in your arms, you would understand. I cannot walk away now. Believe me, I do understand. And I will fight with you. For now, I will head back to the others. You should hurry. It's a long way back down the mountain. Bayek! What? You are no eagle! Are you alright? That was crazy! But amazing! Whoa! Yeah. I thought the old Magi were all gone. You give me hope again. Magi, you've returned! Yes, your sister is staying on the cliff. She will signal when the bandits approach. These ruins are narrow. It could be worthwhile setting traps. Fire and oil, perhaps. Uh, do you have supplies? Fire? Uh, a fine idea. Yes, we do. They're nearby. Good. Head up to that roof and keep watch. I will join you soon. I could use the oil jars to set traps for the bandits. Either way... I should speak to Rai's brother again when I am ready. 
I am ready. Then we wait and pray. <laughs> The bandits are here! There are more of them out there, and they will return. They were after Father's bow. What? All this just for an old bow? God's why? It doesn't make sense. I would have given it to them. Maybe we still can. They would have killed you anyway. There is only one way to stop men like this. I have to hunt down their leader. I saw them come in from the southeast. They could be camping in the foothills nearby. And that is where I will begin my search. Bayek. Before you go, please, take the bow. We'll be safer if you have it. It was damaged in the fighting, and it only brings me sadness now anyway. I'm sure it still has some power. You honor me, Rai. The bow is Egyptian, but older than anything I have seen. It is deceptively light, and the balance is perfect. The limbs are made partly of a strange black stone. It is familiar. I will look into it after I've dealt with this murderous leader. letter from the bandit leader. He's collecting ancient weapons. He wanted this boss so badly he killed for it. But why? He is not here. They have a new hideout in a nearby tomb. They think themselves unfindable. Well, my friends, here I come. Ah, 
Madras greedy Nekatiadet. He will not be troubling the farmers anymore. He was carrying shards of black stone, probably found in the tomb beyond. It is the same material used on Rai's bow. It fits. Should do the trick. Now it is a fine weapon. don't want you playing with him. The man beast lives there. Do you want to be cut in pieces? Now come away. Seni, forgive me. I overheard you just now. You said something about a man beast. The man beast has been taking people from here for months. People have gone missing. Have you told the Philakitai? The Philakitai are useless. Just last week, three fishermen disappeared. Bits of them floated in a few days later. They did nothing. Anyway, we know who it is. That raving old maniac over there. We're watching him. Things are often not what they appear. I should talk to this man-beast. He might be possessed by Sobek himself. He's too crazy to be the man-beast. He never does anything but pray. He is eating the victims of Sobek. No one goes missing on his land. They just show up in the water near his house. We should leave him alone. His poor child. Sobek eats with his mouth. He will not eat. Sobek eats while he mates. He rents whom he will. Anything taken by the current ends up here. Flesh. It is rotting and waterlogged, and hard to identify. It has come here from upstream. This place is a damn slaughter yard. But I cannot tell if the flesh is human. In all my years as a Magi, I have never seen anything like this. It is... There is meat in the baskets for feeding the fish. Gods, that could be human. It is floating here from somewhere farther upstream. My friend, could I speak with you? Do you know anything about the missing people? I am not your friend. Go away from here. So Beck eats with his mouth. He with the pointed teeth. Sobek eats while he mates. He rents whom he will. I will not get anything useful out of him. Hi. What is your name? This is my toy, Sobek. See? He carries his babies in his mouth. Father made it for me. That is a... a nice toy. Can you tell my friends to come back and play? Sobek didn't really eat the people in the river. It's just a game. Look. 
body parts. Where are they all coming from? More blood in the water. It seems to be coming from that cave. and luxury. These look like seats for some kind of theater. Hello? Who said? Wine and Please, refreshments. Please, help me! Whoever sat here was well pampered. Cushions and luxury. These look like seats for some kind of theater. Thank the gods. Hurry, we have to leave before he comes back. Who? Oh, what is happening here? The embalmer. He's throwing people to crocodiles. His guests watch as they're ripped apart. Be calm. You are safe. Where is he now? Safe? No one is safe here. He kidnapped me at the market where I was selling fish. I'm getting out of here. I never imagined anyone could do something like this. I will find a way to the market. This embalmer has given his last show. Send the owl. Help for what? Bede duk ani kabe. Sutros is angry. The image of Sobek shows the God's will. What will we do? I shall heal Sobek. Continue to worship. Bad omen for certain. Something awful is going to happen. Oh, Sobek, forgive us. What can we do? Are our offerings? 
offerings not enough? I already gave half my grain and a hundred flowers. Would gold be better? I thought the sacred crocodiles of Crocodilopolis were tame. I do not know what happened. Petsuchos has never attacked anyone before. His eyes turned red. Did you see? Is Sobek displeased with us? Nick. Even the gods turn their backs on the people. Where is Petsuchos now? Our priest Sehetep took the god back to the pool inside the temple. I have never seen him like this. Something about this is not right. I should take a look at the crocodile's enclosure. Uh. No sign of the priest. But Sutros looks agitated. I should try to stay unnoticed. A carcass. It has been chewed, but not eaten. smelling liquid. Ah, the stench burns my eyes. Ah, Nick. Someone was injured in the enclosure. They went up the staircase. Whoever was wearing this was badly injured. The blood trail leads outside. Mauled by crocodiles. What was he doing back here? This was the man who poisoned the crocodiles. He was taking orders from Melina, the hibiscus. Pretty name for a killer. She's at the Neorian naval arsenal, to the south. Who dares touch a god of Egypt? I will hunt down this blasphemer. Hey! This is the place. The hibiscus should be somewhere nearby. A woman amongst Ptolemy's soldiers should not be hard to find. Sehetep. He was the priest at the temple. Gods. What is it with priests and money? The poison was just for show. Sure. At least the temple crocodiles are not going to die. I should tell the guardian.
Guardian of Sobek. The sickness was not an omen from the gods. Your crocodiles were poisoned, but they will recover. Poisoned? Are you sure? By whom? They will pay with their lives! Your own priest, Sehetep, was responsible. He's trying to increase offerings from your followers. What? Sehetep is Sobek's right hand. He will never do this. What you are saying is blasphemy. Ah, you priests. Forever holding to your superstitions. You have been told the truth. The gods themselves will judge what you do with it. Move! Hurry! Blood pooling beneath this door. Butchered Sobex in Crocodilopolis. Gods, this is an illegal tannery. Hung out to dry like rags. No wonder the place is locked tight. Hiding the murder of gods. That is a lot of gold. Someone is making a big profit from this sacrilege. These mummies are sloppy work. This is the foulest blasphemy. The mummies are stuffed with gold and valuables. Where are they taking them? There are shipping consignment markings on them. Crocodiles are being slaughtered and mummified. The work is sloppy and careless. This is sacrilege beyond imagining. The mummies are used as coin sacks and stacked like packages. They are using the bodies of murdered gods for smuggling. Hamun. The smell alone turns my stomach. Those who do this deserve death. How can this be happening in Egypt? By the gods. It must be stopped. I need to find where the mummies are being shipped. This tannery must have a dock nearby. I don't want someone to is in trouble. Put your nose where it doesn't belong, priest. You know this is wrong. Wrong! Killing Sobek's children, filling their bodies with unclean gold. Who orders such bloodshed and sacrilege? Sobek has chosen his right hand and we must obey him. I'm sorry. I will make this quick. You cannot shed innocent blood. You are meant to protect the temple and the people. Damn you, priest! I have no choice. Knack! I kill you. Ha'a, Mesuk! Hai, big chemer! Thank you, Magi. My life is spared, but it seems much that is good is already dead. I saw the tannery and the mummies. I know what they are doing to Sobek's children. So you have seen it? Do us, Sobek, it is unthinkable. I am Paddy Aset. I serve in the temple south of the city. Forgive me. I must return. I need to pray for guidance. This is going to take more than prayer, priest. We need to act. The mummies had markings on them. I think they are being moved by ship. Ship? The cult has a trireme. It follows trade routes south of the city. Do what you must, Magi. I will pray for you. But please risk no more bloodshed. Bloodshed comes whether we risk it or not. I should search for the ship's manifest. It will tell me where these mummies are headed. Nothing. 
forgive me. When you go back, the bed here we have. Manifest. The cargo's bound for the Trireme stranding camp to the west. More evidence the cult is working with Ptolemy's soldiers. Money, power, corruption. It is always the same. I need to go to that camp and find out more. This is the Trireme stranding camp. Got you. Die, idiot. I will fire the Brazilian. Correspondence between the captain and Sehetep. Sehetep again? That poisonous priest from the northern temple is becoming a big problem. I should let Padia Set know about Sehetep. He is not going to like it. 